Okay. Um, go ahead, Adriana. Hello. Who inspired you and why? Sometimes the people who inspire others are often those who have led difficult lives but overcome, overcame challenges. Most of the time, they are making a difference, however small, to those they need. Today, I will introduce the life of an Afro-American woman. She has inspired millions of people around the world, and she has paved the way for others to become successful. I'm talking about Oprah Winfrey. And I will, expl I will explain uh, background, the background, the Oprah phenomenon, and Oprah now. Oprah was born in 1954 in Kosciuszko, a small town in central Mississippi in the south of the United States. When she was born, um, her mother was poor, single, and had no financial support from Oprah's father. When Oprah was four years old, her mother um, moved left to Wisconsin looking for a better paying job and left Oprah under care um, of her strict grandmother. With her grandmother, Oprah learned to read and to recite. Then, when Oprah was six years old, she, w she moved to Wisconsin with her mother, and they lived in a small apartment. Living there, the place also served as a um, um, shopping ground for some male relatives who stayed there when they don't have any elsewhere to go. Mm. And growing, sadly, growing in this kind of environment, she suffered sexual abuse, and it happens for many years. She keep it a secret. Then, also met her father. She had a modest life, but she believed strongly that education was very important to have a successful life. And under her father's guidance, Oprah became an honorary student. And she um, discovered her public, her, the flair for public speaking. And um, her own her speaking skills earned her a uh, scholarship to Tennessee uh, State University, where she majored in, in speech and drama. Um, Oprah, in 1977, Oprah got a job in a TV program as a news poster, and, but soon she found that hard news wasn't, really, wasn't truly her forte because Sometimes when she was when she was reporting strong news, uh, some of those stories uh, tortured her uh, due to her the, her past, her sad past. But a new um, manager at the station uh, saw uh, in Oprah a new way to make a virtue of the Oprah's um, Oprah's skills to reporting and. In 1977, the, the TV program People Are Talking is this, aired with Oprah as co-host. And the, um, the TV program was an instant success. Why? Because Oprah was found her niche because her um, uncommon ability to connect mental, uh, inter intellectually and mentally with a wide variety of topics made uh, an instant success work. The people love her. Oprah the Phenomenon. In 1984, Oprah's success attracted the attention of um, Chicago Channel 7, and they offered her an opportunity to, to work here in the TV program I Am Chicago, and she accepted. The TV program was a success. Um, was a syndicator in 120 cities quickly. But Oprah's uh, really success was in when she had an, a role in the screen adaptation The Color Purple and she had nominations both for Golden Globe and Academy Awards and this uh, movie was a uh, really success for her and, and in, the, in the United States. Writing the um, publicity Oprah Winfrey show made its national debut in 1986 and was in within five months um, was the number first um, TV, TV talk show in the United States in 192 cities. In the program, Oprah created the Oprah's Book Club and was the most influential book club in the around the world. Frequently, 
um, operas suggest about a book, send the book uh, to the top, the um, bestsellers list. Um, some, commenters, some commenters agree that opera exerts enormous influence, and that influence and her personal following uh, play a key role to, in helping Obama to become the first African-American president of the United States. After 25, after, and after 25 years, she decided to take the last program Oprah, the, of, about Oprah Winfrey Show. And um, in the last program, she, sh she, she shared with the audience her best things that she was learned in, along the way. Oprah now, Oprah now she's a businesswoman. She has her own Oprah Winning Network, what is a channel of TV channel. She owns um, own magazine, own Oprah magazine. She's activist and she is billionaire. According to the Forbes magazine, um, she is the first African American woman to become a uh, billionaire. In conclusion, Oprah um, overcame poverty, um, poverty, parental neglect, sexual abuse, to become one of the richest and most powerful women in the entertainment industry. A lot of people love her, a lot of, a lot of people follow her, and for all these things, a lot of people think that she is somebody who inspires others. Thank you.